Stay ahead with Money FM 89.3. Well, that's right. You're listening to Money FM 89.3, and this is a special broadcast live out of the Singapore FinTech Festival with me, Chua Tian Tian. Now, in this hour, we'll bring you a series of under the radar interviews with companies and organizations within the FinTech space to give you an inside look into the up and coming trends as well as the key announcements and developments to watch. Now, supporting financial institutions in their efforts to leverage technology and transform digitally, that's exactly what we are going to talk about in this session with my guest from Teamers. Now, established in 2021 by Tamasic in partnership with UST, T- uh, Teamers provides digital transformation solutions for the private and public sector and uh, aspires to be a strategic partner in realizing the Singapore government's smart nation vision. The Singapore headquartered firm has over 200 employees across a wide range of disciplines in strategy, design, architecture, technology, data, and AI. Now, in the field of finance specifically, Teamers recently announced a transformative partnership with award winning fintech firm Nexus. Frontier Tech. Now, the collaboration aims to revolutionize the landscape of investing with the introduction of an AI augmented portfolio management solution tailored for asset managers seeking unparalleled efficiency and performance. Now, question is what is the rationale behind this move and how far will this benefit FIs in Singapore? Now, for more, I have with me on site here at the Singapore Expo, Marcus Lowe, director at Teamers. Marcus, welcome. Hello, Tian Tian. Thank you for having me on Money FM live at the Singapore FinTech Festival. That's right. Uh, great to have you on. And let's get right straight to the topic, right? Uh, talk a little bit more about Teamers, right? It is a company that provides digital transformation solutions for public and private sectors, right? Uh, mainly three services, value architecting, consulting, and IT services. Uh, but tell us more specifically when we look at services provided to financial institutions, what are we looking at? Sure, happy to weigh in. So there's clearly plenty of buzz about fintech. And this excitement has only been turbocharged by the promises of AI. As a digital transformation champion for Singapore and the region, leading financial institutions have taken a growing interest in what Teamers has to offer. And here are three reasons why. Demand, discipline and digital. Mm. Global investment in fintech reached $74 billion Sing dollars in the first half of this year. Right. Singapore attracted $6 billion last year. And the top three investment areas are blockchain, payments and wealth tech. That's the first reason why. So there's clear demand. But mm. fintech firms need investments. And investors today have pivoted from future business valuations to a PL model. They are looking at metrics like revenue, acquisition numbers, profitability. And mm. this is where Teamers enters the picture. So we partner with fintechs to find a path to value. We partner also with BFSI firms to unlock new sources of value with digital capabilities. Mm. And to use a sporting analogy, Tian Tian, yeah. Teamers help sprinters run marathons. Mm. We help marathoners run faster. And wow. if you need more runners in your team, we'll even hire, place and train them for you. Okay. And so, you've briefly talked a little bit more about your value proposition and the business model, but in terms of the gap that FIs face when it comes to digital transformation, yeah. what is the number one gap that they face? How do you bridge that for them? Sure. So, we define our value proposition in three words, vision to value. Mm-hmm. For fintech firms today, unfortunately, a bright future isn't enough. And vision to value helps these enterprises to bring their future forward. And we do it in three ways. Mm. The first way is we match future valuation with present value creation. It goes hand in hand. Secondly, as we create long-term economic value for companies, we do it in conjunction with societal impact. And the third area, the gap that we bridge, is that when companies obsess with technology, they think that digital is all about technology, unfortunately, a lot of those projects go wrong. Mm -hmm. Customers that do well in digital transformation do well because they consider people and culture. It's that intersection, right? Technology, people and processes. And Teamers right. brings it all together. All right. So being the gel uh, towards digital transformation. Um, but let's take a look at your clientele, right? Uh, Teamers, 
established in partnership by Tomasic and uh, UST. And it's no surprise there that you serve a lot of blue chip firms, those listed on the SGX and the public sector mm. across all industries. But take us through your clientele where the financial industry uh, is concerned. How important is the financial industry uh, to team us when we look at profit generation? Absolutely. And, and indeed, you're right, Tian Tian. Customers from virtually all sectors have tapped on teamers for digital transformation. Energy, infrastructure, government agencies, and of course, BFSI. Yes. And let me share a little bit about the impact that we are bringing to the BFSI space, right? So in conjunction with the Singapore FinTech Festival this week, Tomasic Trust and the Monetary Authority of Singapore announced a collaboration to attract global capital to high potential opportunities in Singapore and beyond, mm. right? But what makes this possible is an open, tech-based platform by the Global FinTech Institute. They call it FLEX. Mm. Teamus is involved in developing this digital marketplace where fintechs connect with potential investors. They streamline the investment journey into three easy steps, right? So browse, analyze, and invest. And the first phase of Flex will be launched in the first half of 2024. Hmm. I'll give you another example. So in yep. addition to growing firms like uh, GFSI, Teamus also helps established market leaders to grow more. Mm -hmm. And a sense of the importance of the financial sector to Teamus, one of the reasons why we have established an operation in Hong Kong is because our top BFSI customers based in Singapore also have a significant presence in Hong Kong. And one of these firms is the FWD Group, mm. which is a global digital insurance provider. Yes. Teamers partnered with FWD to build a lifestyle super app called Omni. Yeah. And we launched it in August last year. It does three things. It brings together an ecosystem of lifestyle partners for individual users. Mm. Omni delivers a hyper-personalized experience with the power of AI. And we help each individual user to live his or her best life in big ways through unlocking small and positive experiences through the app. All right, you bring in a number of examples and let's take a look at the road ahead, right? We are seeing a number of key developments surrounding Teamers yourself as well, right, mm -hmm. Marcus? Uh, recently announced a transformative partnership with award-winning fintech firm called Nexus Frontier Tech and the collaboration aims to revolutionize the landscape of investing yeah. with the introduction of AI augmented portfolio management solutions yes. tailored for asset managers seeking unparalleled efficiency. Yes. Now three things here, what is the rationale behind the move? What is the role of teamers in this regard? And what can firms in the financial industry expect here? Sure, happy to share. So here is the secret. We are building a secret weapon for <laughs> asset managers. <laughs> So today, you know, we know that asset managers are grappling with the complexity of information, right? Mm -hmm. And this, all this data is scattered across different tools, different systems. This leads to the challenge of gathering and governing data promptly. Mm -hmm. And this impacts directly compliance, risk assessment, and other downstream operations. Yes. So powered by AI and machine learning, we introduce OneNexus. And it's essentially a platform that empowers asset managers to generate smart financial analysis reports, multi-source intelligence, and monitor risk exposure together with ESG impact using real-time market surveillance. Mm. So think of one Nexus as an Iron Man exoskeleton for asset yes. managers, right? It's essentially, that's what AI augmented portfolio management system can do for you. Mm. And if you're just tuning in, we're now in conversation with Marcus Lowe, Director at Teamers. Well, Marcus, one of the themes for this year's Singapore FinTech Festival is applications of artificial intelligence. Mm. And AI has been the word of the year, right? How far do you think AI will influence the way in which Teamers takes the company forward in terms of product pipeline in particular? And how will that speed up the rate of digital transformation in the world of finance? Sure, you know, we are really thrilled at this prospect of a Singapore where individuals and enterprises can harness AI for their maximum potential. The problem is only 53% of AI projects mm -hmm. make it from prototype to production. Oh, okay. So there is immense value clearly mm -hmm. if you are able to harness it well. And sure. it revolves around three areas process, presence, and people. So let me explain. We are familiar with this concept of the Internet of Things, right? Yes. Where products are connected to the Internet, you have visibility over them, you have control over them remotely. With AI, companies can now create self-optimizing supply chain systems, mm. right? They're able to bridge the digital and the physical streams a lot more seamlessly, mm. automated inspections that leverage drone technology. So at Teamus, we are partnering with a company called Laconic, Mm -hmm. to build a global environmental intelligence platform to unlock value in the carbon markets. 
so yeah. that we can tackle climate change. And you know, valuing carbon credits is totally dependent on accurate and verifiable environment data. This platform we're building with Laconic processes data from IoT sensors, mm. drones, satellites in real time. We tag them and then we provide users with AI powered recommendations and critical alerts, right? So the first yeah. one is process. The second one is presence. And this is where we partner with strategic partners like Amazon Web Services. We enable AI to perform through the cloud. Mm. Companies can then tap on the power of AI virtually from anywhere. And then the third part here is people. Yes. Now we're seeing the rise of a new approach to AI through no code. So low mm. code or no code, right? People don't need a data science skill to be able to work with AI. Yep. At Teamus, we've got a practice that focuses on that. So we've used low code to build essentially a digital mobile platform called Giga for mm. Starhub. Yes. When we launched it, we launched it in six months. This takes years to launch. We launched it in six months. We were able to grow five times over the same year. Mm. And this is about 333% faster than the region's trend of mobile telcos. Mm. Yeah, so I think uh, presence, people, and having processes that can harness AI will turbocharge digital transformation in a massive way. You were talking about some 330%, right? And uh, I suppose that the solution, low code, can be applied to different sectors for you, the finance industry, is a matter of use cases. Yeah. And on that note, I do want to talk about one interesting development as well, uh, which is you guys in April signed a partnership teamers with AI Singapore to catalyze digital transformation, promote AI adoption, yes. develop new AI technologies, solutions, applications, particularly for firms based here in Singapore. Yes. Tell us more about that. What would it mean for the industry here? Sure. So there's a saying, right, that if I can see further, it's only because I'm standing on the shoulders of giants. Yeah. And as a small but fast growing company, teamers actively seeks out like minded giants in their own mm -hmm. domains who see immense value in partnering with us, you know? So in April, you're right, we inked a partnership with AI Singapore. Both of us saw an opportunity to contribute to Singapore's national AI strategy, reinforce Singapore's position as a global AI hub, and to do it by helping companies to become AI ready. So as part of this collaboration, we will push together mm. for AI adoption and deployment for more than 100 AI companies to be ready. Mm. And, you know, with AI Singapore, they get to tap on solutions, products. And with Teamers, we get to make these solutions real and impactful through vision to value to mm. their business, right? Uh, so, for example, we've had a joint project that we're working on with a Singapore-based aviation company. At the preliminary stage, what we're trying to do is assess whether they could be ready. We're using AI to collect unstructured data from all around so that yes. this company can be a lot more efficient in bargaining, in mm. negotiating, in managing mm. uh, their contracts a lot more efficiently. Right. And let's talk about this very quickly. I have about two minutes to go. Uh, team is announcing in November that it acquired homegrown digital services provider Decision Science Agency. Now, the acquisition target, as we know, is focused on agile application development. Yeah. How does that add value to the suite of services you provide to firms within the financial sector? Sure. Those three ways. The first way is that it helps our customers to create seamless digital customer journeys. That's yes. number one. Number two, we are able to now champion even better an agile and data-guided approach to building UI, user interfaces, experiences. But thirdly, I think this is interesting because it really helps us to grow our portfolio of customers in the government sector and at the same time in the BFSI sector, which Decision Science serves now. So you're, mm. you're looking at names like MAS, Bank of Singapore, MetLife, UOB, Prudential, Great Eastern, Aviva, yes. and this is just to name a few. Mm. And so we're looking at BFSI as a sector with a lot of uptake, and we are looking to service them even more efficiently with these insights. Right, and I have about half a minute to go. Um, lots of exciting plans for you guys at Teamers. So the big question, what's next for you? What's brewing? So what's brewing is that we think that we are only limited by our size. Sure. But we shouldn't be limited by our size, and Teamers should be a part of that solution. Hmm. And this is the reason why we launched a career conversion program to help people with no prior tech experience to become coders, builders, developers in Singapore's digital economy. Hmm. Uh, this program is called Step It Up. It's open to everyone. We have run two runs already, and we have got people from platform delivery riders to even a jazz musician yes. who were able to convert. Hmm. We have converted about 40 people. We are now recruiting for our third wave. Applications close on the 20th of November. Hmm. Come and be a part of our digital journey. Come and help Singapore to forge and secure relevance in a digital world, in the hmm. digital future. We invite Singaporeans to join us on this journey. I know you work closely with uh, low code firm uh, OutSystems as well. So thanks a lot, Marcus. That was Marcus Lowe, Director at Teamus. Thank you very much for joining us on Money FM 89.3. <laughs> 
under the radar.